veterans are at a 72% higher risk of suicide than those who have not served. That's all according to the Government Accountability Office. And to raise awareness for veteran suicide, March for the 22 was born. Participants walk 22 miles from Maysville to Union Point Park in New Bern, and they didn't seem to mind the on and off rain. News 12's Elena Lester is live tonight. Where it all ended, Elena, they're sharing a powerful message. They are Val here at Union Point Park. It was full of people just a little bit ago who arrived here after the 22 mile walk from Maysville this morning. That all started at about 530, so it's been a full day of walking for them. This all came from a grim statistic in 2020 that on average, 22 veterans a day take their own lives. Since then, the group has gotten together to raise awareness for those veterans through this march. I caught up with some veterans or with some walkers along their trip at their second stop, a trip to Moore's Barbecue. It's a purpose. Hey, 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 money, hey, money. Through rain and shine, this group came together to march 22 miles for veteran suicide awareness. Susan Collier and her son Matthew Walston have been doing the march together for the past three years. I don't think people are aware of the suicide rates of veterans, and I think it's getting more and more every year. There is hope, there is, there is help out there, and you know, that's the main reason. Do it for the ones that, that we've lost and the ones that are struggling. She says that being able to raise awareness means a lot to her. Both my sons are retired Marines and my husband's a retired Marine, and it just means a whole lot to us to be able to help. Ryan Andrews is a veteran who joined the march as he saw them pass by his house. I went in my shed and grabbed this flag and ran out and caught up with them as fast as I could. That's how, that was my experience. I didn't even know this was going on. Victoria McGowan says she walked today to support her friends and family who served. Most people don't know until they see stuff like this and, you know, we're walking down the middle of downtown and they're like, oh, okay, that's what that is. Yeah. The 22 mile trek included one more pit stop at Freshwater Beer Company before finishing off at Union Point Park. As you can see, it has calmed down here quite a lot and now those walkers are taking that rest and relaxation time. Live in New Bern, I'm Elena Laster, News 12.